Now, the one my dad says there's a battery connection problem. Last time I did cold start on here, it uh, just clicked. Uh, I don't think it's a starter, I think it's a bad battery connection. Um, I'm not going to take it down the road, I don't think, because um, I don't know, I just don't want to. So, um, let's turn that thing off here. And let's just see what it does here. Yeah, there it did it again. Maybe it is a starter. Hmm. What's this, Ford not start day? Maybe that's the solenoid on the starter, it sounds like. Sounds like the solenoid isn't engaging. Hmm. Battery's fine. messed around with that there. That's tight. That's tight. I think it's a starter. I hate to have that starter stick on on me. That'd be bad. Yeah, it would. Unless the engine's locked up. Never thought about that. Maybe. Just got oil. Well, you never know. The engine was pretty tired. But I wouldn't think so. I wouldn't think so. Yeah, where can I set this camera so you guys can listen? Well, I'll set you guys down by the starter down here. And that's under here. And you won't be able to see the starter, but just listen. Starter either has a bad spot on it or the solenoid's not working. As long as the starter is a sticking on now. Yeah. I didn't think the engine would be locked up. It's the starters going on it. That's what it is. Let's see, what's she charging good? Yeah, she's charging normal. Oh, pressure's good. I hate to shut it off again, but let's try it and see if she starts here. Maybe the starter does have a bad spot on it. Let's look at how fast it started. Try it again here. Confused. One more time. Let's sit a minute.
What the fuck? It smokes every time I start it up. That don't make sense. It smells good. Runs good. Holy crap, there's a lot of stuff on that muffler. I get that off there. There we go. Sounds okay. Must have got a fucked up solenoid on the starter or something. Something's wrong. Wait, my air conditioner works. Why am I doing that? I got air conditioner for God's sakes. I think I do. I got it. Uh, let's see here. I got air conditioner. Yeah! Even that brown Ford has air conditioner. That's older yet. Go easy on her. She's old. Tired. Come on, baby. I was going to try to check oil on the rear end. I should probably do that. Probably be smart. I'll back her up here. Just be easy on her. She's a cold diesel. Even if it's 80 degrees out, it doesn't mean to rev her. Well, Mechanic Dave, if I pronounce your name right, there it is right there. And it looks like somebody's already checked it or filled it up. Or if it was my dad. But we're going to check it anyways. So there it is right there next to the speedometer sensor. So, I will see Carl underneath there and we'll check her if we can get it off, I hope. Well, there's the speedometer connection there and there it is there. Let's see if we wire them up and see if it works too while I'm at it. I don't know. I just wired the speedometer for now. Hopefully it works. Hey, the speedometer's working now. Look at that. There, it's working. <laughs> there we go. Just what we needed. There we go. The speedometer's working. For how long, though? First time I've ever seen a speedometer work. There we go. show my dad that. wonder how long it'll work. Oh! It stops instantly because of the rear axle leaking. Now the miles per hour, miles, how many miles it went on there, it'll be on accurate a little bit. I wonder if I'll get stuck here. <laughs> 